lot of people. Hi. Turkey. Huh? You look tired. <laughs> you okay? Yep. I have five minutes here. Oh, nice. She was My ready. Screamer. So come on down here. The three of you are going to line up here on the trap door. That's right. Just do it. We're going to just see what happens once you get lined up here. All right. So you guys are going to be my featured extras. You're going to be my screamers. I'm going to go down the line. Let's put you in the middle. There you go. And I'll let you say your name and where you're from. Yes? Richie from Clinton, Massachusetts. Richie. Yes, ma'am? Christina from New Jersey. Corey from South Carolina. <laughs> Alright, I'm looking for some people in a good mood. Let's see some people in a good mood. Okay, yeah. Richie, Richie, Top, the lady there. Let's see right here in the um, Mickey Mouse ears. Yeah, let's see over oh, there. Somebody in a good mood. Okay. Good. You, sir, you're pointing at me. I'm pointing at you. You're pointing back at me. You're taking your sunglasses off. Yes, yeah, so the three of you. Let's see how many people have actually seen an Indiana Jones movie before. Raise your hand. Whoa. My goodness, a lot of you. Come on up here. So, you know, in addition to the action, lighthearted moments in our uh, film. So these guys are going to be my laughers. Hello! I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, actually, let's put you down at that end. There you go. So we're going to see it this way. Alright, so uh, once again, you're going to tell me your name. Where are you from? Brooke from Brooklyn. <laughs> Just keeps walking. 
I am going to give you a pose, and you're going to hold that pose until I say otherwise. We're going to put her in the middle. Oh, it's Barbara. Look at her. All right, only unless you're wearing a fake name. It's no, I'm Barbara. All right, so I'm going to give you each a pose. You hold that pose until I say otherwise. Okay, what is your name? Where are you from? Bill from Atlanta, Georgia. Yeah. All right, Bill from Atlanta, Georgia. Your pose is that you're falling off a cliff. All right, so a little bit of action here. You're like, yeah, yeah, like that. Uh. Yeah, do the noise. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Good job, Bill. All right, I really like the lead in. That's my favorite. But yeah, let's do it again. Ah. <laughs> Perfect. Like a hundred year old man. <laughs> All right, you just. Perfect. You stay right there. Oh dear. All right. Hello. Your name is Barbara from Virginia. Barbara from Virginia. It's your birthday. Fantastic. All right. So Barbara, you're taking a little walk, and oh, she's snapping. Look at her. And you see a man falling off a cliff. You're terrified. Oh, that's good. Right there. There's your pose. That's it. Ooh, look, he's found his center. I like that. Oh, oops. Not really. Okay. Hello, sir. What's your name? Where are you from? Jim from Port Orange, Florida. Jim from Florida? Yeah. Oh, don't you worry, Jim. They're going to all be cheering for you soon enough. I have a very special pose for you. All right, Jim. Watch. Here we go. And. Bam, chick -a bam, chick -a bam. Don't you worry. Bring it. You ready, Jim? Here we go. Bow, chicka, bow, chicka, bow, bow, bow. Yeah, we run over all the posters. Yeah, good job. You can stop there. Shake it out. You're going to go to the top of the stairs, hit the wardrobe. Another big round of applause for all the volunteers. Woo. All right, now I did forget about you guys. I love your energy. I'm going to give you a line. This side, high nice style. Let's practice. Ooh. And they remember that we're going to play a little trick on somebody a little bit later. Also, you guys are in charge of all of our crowd reactions. So when you see Indiana Jones for the very first time, and every time he does one of his stunts, I want you to go nuts cheering and clapping and screaming. Let me hear you. That's right. All the way from Wisconsin. Look at them. Here they come. So I'm going to line you up. Let's go. Uh, let's scoot you down to this end, sir. There you go. Oh, look at them. They're adorable. All right. So tell me your name and your age. My name is Trey. I'm 12. Trey's 12. All right. Preston is 8. Preston is 8. Hello. Lane. Yeah. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's good. And how old are you? Four. Yeah! All right! Okay, now the three of you know those three magical words that are going to get us started. The audience is going to go crazy. It'll give them a chance to practice. They're clapping and cheering. I'll make sure you know what we're doing, and then we're going to do this, all right? All right, on three, I'll count you down. Three, two, one.
That's perfect, sir. <laughs> That's amazing. All right, try this. You're on hot coals, everybody. Very hot coals. That looks great. Now nah, you're in a video. You're very talented. Look at you. Yeah. Everybody shimmy. Everybody shimmy. I turn Point up. Point down. Bring me a lead to your right. Lead to your right. You're all three of you are wrong. You're not right. And one of you is still wrong. That's good. All right. Thank you. Sir, you having a good time? Let's fix that. Come on down here. <laughs> What's your name? Corey? Where are you from? It's Corey from South Carolina, everybody! That was Corey, you said? Okay, Corey, I'd like to give you your very own steam. You like that? It'll be fun. Nothing dangerous. Just call it very simply Corey's Death Sea. <laughs> so not for your very role, Corey. What's going to happen is this. You approach me with an imaginary knife. You can use mine. Now I'm going to show you the poisonous guard to keep you wow. from moving from that deck, Corey. It's now your job to give all these people the most over-the-top, loudest, longest, death scene ever. So when I first shoot you, you'll just fall down the bench right away. It's your job to hand this up. You have this whole area here to stack around and hesitate. Play it out that way the whole time, Corey, if you can. Yell like you're in great agony. Let me hear you all real loud right now. Like an A-B death delivery. Very nice. Yeah. All right, guys, I think Corey, it's your job. Time to that lady's holding all your fast passes for the week. All right, now face me, Corey. Hold up your knife. Good, you've done this before. Oh, South Carolina, I'm sure you have. Okay, good. <laughs> when I say action, approach me slowly. But first, Corey, do me a favor. Give me a menacing look. <laughs> Not a seductive look, Corey, but thank you. How about an angry look? There you go. Or confused. Just stay with that. That's good. Ready? Here comes Corey. Oh, he's got his move on his own. He's in. He's going to face out that way and yell real loud. Where the people are, Corey. Get close to them. They're that way. I'm going to push it, Corey. There you go. <laughs> it looks like you're angry and sleepwalking. And you stub your toe. That's what it looks like, Corey. <laughs> hey, let me help you. There's another one for you. What a slow start that was. Now, Corey, roll about a thousand times to get out of here. Roll it, roll it, roll it. Very important. 
small group, but in this film you have to represent the entire population of Cairo. Can you do it? Yeah! You're staying with it, right, Mindy? The whole scene. Fantastic. All right, now be safe, everybody. Drive on down. You got it, boss. All right, places, everybody, please. Places, all the extras. Mindy, face this way. Thumbs up, everybody. Are you ready? Thank you very much. Stunt teams. Ready. All right, Vidal, you got set? Camera's ready, Johnny. Responsible for that last effect. He's responsible for the bullet hits, 
fire effects, and all the explosions here on the set. Special effects coordinator, demolitions expert, and two! Hey! Explain to the audience the dangers of working with explosives. <laughs> when you work with explosives, it's dangerous. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Kids, stay in school. <laughs> Let's see if I can elaborate on that a little bit. Working with explosives is one of the most dangerous things a stunt person has to deal with. But I bet you'd be surprised that more stunt people get hurt during a simple fight routine than they do by performing elaborate stunts like the one you just saw. It's because when I worry about the stunt fight, my guys are throwing punches and swinging axe handles with the same intensity it takes to really hit somebody that you have to miss by just a couple inches. Each move is carefully choreographed. You must be committed to memory like a line of dialogue. It takes timing, practice, and coordination to really make it look like you're hitting somebody to, well, to really sell it. You know what? We have a couple extra minutes. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Maybe I borrow one of your uh, extras, a little fight demonstration. This guy, come on out here. Big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, hurt this guy here. How you doing, sir? What's your name? Bill. Hey, John, what? Grab me one of my guys and really throw a punch, yeah? You got it. Uh, hey, Mark. Yeah. Boss wants you to hit that guy. Come on, sure. Right foot out a little bit. Or right foot, whatever makes you comfortable, right? Okay. Tight fist up here, mean look. That's gonna have to do. All right, turn around, this is the guy you're fighting right here. Oh, man, Mark, I couldn't have been a little bigger than I had in mind. I needed the next shot. Get set up for that, will you? Let's see if we can find somebody a little more your own size here. <laughs> Bill, hey, Jackie. Yeah? Come here for a minute, will you? <laughs> Bill, this is Jackie. This is Bill. And I need to do a little fight demonstration with Bill. Small, little, not like the last time, right? Never happened last time. Ah, yeah. Hey, Bill, no worries. This is going to be fun, all right? We're going to fight demonstration.
between a stunt actor like yourself and stunt doubles like Jackie and Dale. Jackie, Dale, help him out, will you? Yeah, sure. Okay, so as a stunt actor, I actually play the role of the German mechanic in the next scene. And there'll be doubles for me because I do all my own stunts, so that's a little bit different from a stunt double. That's right, as a stunt double, it's my job to make you think that I'm Harrison Ford. And that I'm Karen Allen. Now, some actors like Harrison like to do their own stunts. Sometimes the risk of injury, well, that's far too great. The big star got injured on set, we shut the whole production down. Besides, if Harrison and I are doing our jobs correctly, even our own best friends won't be able to tell us apart. Hey guys, change in this next step. We're going to go over right now, please. Hey Dale, what's the difference between you and Harrison Ford? What's that, Mark? It's $20 million. <laughs> it's only 40 or so, you know? <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's the change. Now, when Felix starts firing down on Dale here, you panic, hit the control, start spinning around in circles, right? You come around the first time, not the third, but the first. That's when I want you to grab the machine gun and let it happen. You got it? A lot of firepower in this next setup, so please be careful and hit your marks, yeah? John, call places! All right, place everybody, please. Places! Ladies and gentlemen, this last scene is the culmination of all the effects you've seen so far. What you're about to watch would not be possible without the collective efforts of the entire cast and crew who put it all together as a team to get the shot and create what we like to call here on the Indiana Jones set a little movie magic. Right, guys? John, let's go! We got it, boss. All right, Felix, ready in the hill. Thank you very much. Let's do Effects ready? We're all set. Game ready, Johnny. Now we're standing by, JT. Quiet and set it, buddy, please. Quiet, please. Roll cameras. We are rolling. Take one more. Playback. 